Hi friends, Christy here. Welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing two quick and easy Dollar Tree DIYs. If this is your first time tuning in, welcome to my channel. If you like what you see, please make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and also click the notification bell so you can receive notifications and alerts whenever I upload a new video. But let's go ahead and start crafting. For our first DIY, we're going to be using this sign that I purchased from Dollar Tree a little while back. It says there's no place like home. We're going to just use our screwdriver and peel off uh, the galvanized uh, part of that sign because we're going to use that for our project and we'll set the other um, piece of it aside. Um, then I also got this from Hobby Lobby. It was on sale. It was after... Uh, St. Patrick's Day, so I decided to go ahead and get it just because I liked the way it looked and I figured I could use it for a project. So I'm just going to go ahead and screw off the back um, stand part on it and then I'm going to turn it around and I'm going to paint it white using my Waverly White Chalk Paint. Now this sign here, I did get that from Dollar Tree also. I actually purchased quite a few of these um, just because I thought they were cute and I could use them for multiple different projects. Um, so for this piece, I'm just going to take off the little um, holders for the calendar pieces and then I'm going to turn it around. I'm actually going to use the back side of it uh, just because the wording right there that says shoot for the stars is kind of um, embedded in the picture. Uh, so I'm just going to go ahead and use the other side of it just because it's a little bit easier to use. And I'm just going to remove the um, string and then I'm going to also remove the staples. I'm going to smooth that out with sandpaper even though you do not see that. Um, but I'm going to do that and then uh, once I have that done I'm going to paint it with my, um, I believe I'm using ink chalk paint from Waverly. And then um, I am going to get a really good coat. Now I'm going to go ahead and grab my piece back that I painted white and I'm going to just um, dry brush a little bit of the brown on there. I believe I'm using Truffle uh, by Waverly also, but I'm just going to just give it a little bit of a rustic uh, weathered look to it and then I'm going to hot glue the no, There's No Place Like Home sign in the middle of that white portrait. Next, I decided to go ahead and use some burlap. Um, so I'm just going to cut it down to size and then I'm going to hot glue it on the top of my piece uh, and the back of it. And then I decided to also um, just to dress it up a little bit more. Um, I'm taking this buffalo check uh, ribbon that I got from I think Hobby Lobby, um, but I believe it was on sale when I got it. Um, but I am going to just go ahead and make a cute little bow and then I'm going to hot glue that to the top where the burlap is. Lastly, I decided to use a little bit of greenery that I'm going to hot glue on one of the bottom edges of our piece. So 
So for our second project, I am using some of the same pieces that I incorporated in the first one. Um, so we're going to start with the Shoot for the Stars sign. I am going to paint the back side of it again, but this time with the white Waverly um, chalk paint. While that's drying, I'm going to grab this other little stand. This one says best family ever. So I'm just going to do the same thing and I'm going to peel off that galvanized piece because that's the part that I'm going to be using for this project. Um, and then I decided on this one also to use the stand in the back of it as well. So I'll be taking that off here shortly also. But um, I'm going to use some of my burlap so I'm going to cut it to size just how I did on the other one. But this one I decided I'm going to um, use it uh, more of um, a wider piece. Um, so I cut that down to size, then on the burlap I decided to use that, or on um, the buffalo check I decided to use that again as well, um, but this time I decided to um, use it in the middle of the burlap, and then I'm just going to glue that down into the back side of our project. Now once those are on there, I'm going to take the best family sign and I'm going to hot glue it in the center of our piece that we're using. <laughs> And then I'm just going to take some greenery and I'm going to put it on both sides of our Best Family Ever sign and I'm just going to hot glue those underneath it. And then I decided to go ahead and take some twine and just wrap it into a bow and hot glue that into the corner of our project. So there we have it, our two projects that we did today. They were super simple and easy to do. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure to give my video a thumbs up, leave a comment below, and let me know which one was your favorite. Also, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please make sure to do so and hit that notification bell so that you can receive notifications anytime I upload a new video. Uh, I look forward to seeing you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you soon.